I am Game Guy, it's time for more Let's Play Majora's Mask! Well, that monkey's probably dying a horrible, painful death, but you know what? It's alright. Uh, I got a new song, and I can use it to go somewhere. Waterfall? Woodfall shortcut, sorry. It was, it was very hard to read. It seems like the screen got smaller for some reason. It's weird. I'm not sure why it happened. Oh gosh, these dragonflies. These guys, it's a dragonfly. Stay away from its tail. Uh, please. Just just don't even don't even touch it. All right. Dawn of the second day. If you can do it, uh you have to wait for them to kind of lunge at you a bit. If you pop out while they're there, that will kill them. Generally the best way to do such things. I'm a little confused actually cuz um that whole screen getting smaller thing is kind of a, a thing that the game does sometimes as we approach the next day, because now it's the second day, you see. Um, it didn't do the full thing for some reason. Usually it does. I'm not sure why it didn't. I guess because I went through that little area transition. I guess? I don't know why that stopped it, because usually it doesn't seem like that does, but whatever. I won't complain. Honestly, I never really got the whole shrinking screen thing. It's just a little bit weird. Ah, oh, so here's a consistent thing, by the way. On the second day, it will be raining. Uh, in most places. So, you know. This is relevant to a few things, so do keep it in mind. Hello, Owl. You are probably my friend, right? What business might you have in this poison swamp? If you dare not venture further, you shall pass. I shall pass no judgment. I am an owl. I am incapable of that, probably. Oh, the swamp you are in has lost its guardian deity. It must be destined. It was destined to fade away. What? I have a hard time reading your words, Mr. Owl. I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh, if you have courage and determination to proceed in the face of destiny, I shall teach you something useful. Before coming here, had you not seen any of the stone statues that bear close resemblance to me? I sure did. I have placed those throughout the land to aid one with the power to change the destiny of this land. Well, that was awful nice of you. Wherever he may appear. I'm right here, guy. Uh, if you have left proof of our encounter in these statues, there's a song you can use. Remember it well. well. From the first time you play this song, we shall become eternal friends, transcending time and place. Is that a translation error? I mean, I guess not. Notes are carved in the stone. Gotcha. Music time. For some reason, ocarina noises are coming out of my deco pipes. I don't understand why, but whatever. Now it's normal. Whatever. <laughs> That's always been a weird thing, because you're pretty much guaranteed to be a deco scrub when you approach this statue. So, you know... Kind of a weird oddity. I learned the song of soaring though. It swoops you up and sends you soaring to a stone bird statue in an instant. It's pretty convenient. Uh, I'll have to show that off a little bit later because uh, I'm not exactly in the greatest of places to show that off. So, uh, you know. It's all right. It's fine. Welcome, friends to a big pool of poison water known as Woodfall. The moon is ever present. Do not forget it. Uh, this place is a, a pretty big open area that has various things to get. There's a treasure chest all the way at the end, but it's fine. I'm gonna bounce along over to here. Hello, you. That's a hip loop. They're hot headed. Um, you just wanna kind of shoot them with a bubble, actually. Generally, that's all that needs to be done. All right. Hey there, guy. I'm gonna shoot a bubble in your face. 
Just be careful not to fall off. And also, when you're close to these guys, you can just bop them in the face. I could use a Deku stick, that might be nice. Might be nice indeed. Hello down there, I'm gonna go ahead and drop a nut on you. Get out of here with this. All right. I'm not really a big fan of using the Deku Nut from the air. It just doesn't feel like it works super well sometimes. Aiming it is a little difficult, but I decided to do it there because I felt like it. And here we are. Isn't this a Deku Scrub Mark? I wonder if they worshipped here. I don't know, maybe. There's an owl statue here though, which is important. I'm gonna take a stab at that. All right. Now that we have the song soaring, by the way, that is our key to uh, being able to fast travel to any of the owl statues we've played with our, we've hit with the sword, is what I'm attempting to say. I am not saying it particularly well. Uh, before we do anything here, actually, I want to go ahead and take a look around. By the way, got a fairy in a bottle. That's pretty cool, right? This guy is kind of a nuisance and in my way. Thank you for dropping a nut today. I'm gonna head on over here because there's a big old inconspicuous cave on the edge of the map. All right. Oh, it's the fairy's fountain. Hello. You seem a little broken up today. Oh, kind one, please hear our plea. Please find the fairies in the Woodfall Temple. Okay. Oh, they refill my magic. That's nice also. All right, well, it looks like another great fairy has been destroyed. Tragic. You know, I never did go back to the first great fairy. I should probably do that. I have a feeling I'm probably not actually going to go to the dungeon in this episode, so, you know, get excited for that. Uh, so, let's just move around here. It's fine, you know, because there's a lot to do in this game, honestly. And while admittedly it makes a lot of sense to wait until after doing the first dungeon to really start doing things in this game, there are a bunch of things you can still do. So, uh, you know... I've been doing pretty good with dropping the nuts on these guys, so, you know. I somehow got you with a lingering hitbox. Oh yeah, big treasure chest! Deku Link's small enough, he's gotta hop inside. Yeah! Heart piece for me! Alright, that maximizes my health a little bit. Uh, there's another treasure chest over there. What's in that? You know, it's probably gonna be money, and I actually don't have room for more money. I missed a chest over by the thing. Yeah, I figured that'd be money. Well, you know, that's not the correct button. I'm gonna have to really get used to that. So, Song of Soaring, very useful. Uh, this is why you absolutely want to hit that owl statue back in Clocktown, because it's a useful warp point. These statues are worth more than just quick saves, so make sure you grab them. It's very important that you do. I'm gonna go ahead and I guess deposit money. Unfortunately, it seems like I lost all the money that I had gained. Truly tragic, you know, time travel and all that. Please allow me to speak to you, sir. You need something? Oh, yeah, I'll just deposit money. Let me take a look at you. Oh, right, I have the stamp. Well, good, my money is safe. I still have my 83 rupees ready and waiting to go. Who cares about time travel? I'm basically just robbing this guy at this point. It's fine. Uh, if I can find more money, I should be able then to... Whoa, hello, postman. Where, what are you doing? What are you doing? Postman's having a good day. What, what is... I'm gonna say hello to Postman. Why not? He's here. Hello. Oh, this is a problem. It's a real big problem. Not a single letter was mailed. What should I do this afternoon? I wish someone would tell me. I don't know. Go do stuff. Well, Postman has a, an existential crisis going on. 
I guess. Yeah, there's a few things back in town I really should probably do real quick, like... Uh, first and foremost, the Great Fairy needs to be re-completed. Stay away from that flower, because Mr. Guy is going to fly down and be a nuisance again. And I ain't got time for his shenanigans. Not today. Not ever. Uh, we gotta get this fairy again. Yes, I know. I, I've already saved you once. I forget exactly when. At a certain point in time. Yeah, alright. You see how there's there's money down there? You, you could have seen it better from back ways. Yeah, there you go. There's some money down there. At certain points throughout the day, the money will just kind of flow underneath uh, the grating and into that river. You can just collect it at some point. I think it's like available evening of the second day or something. I don't quite remember, but I mean, it's just some free money you can get. Uh, speaking of free money you can get, something that's actually very important to note. Uh, in this particular area, over here, East Clock Town, this is actually a little bit easier to do later, but I'm going to go ahead and do it now, because you should be able to. Uh, if you do a roll before you jump, you actually gain a little bit more distance uh, than you otherwise would. You can jump across these and make your way up here. Um, all the way back over here, you will find a super sweet treasure chest. What's inside is your wildest dreams. A silver rupee worth a hundred. I'm gonna have to throw a single rupee on the ground, though. It's truly tragic. But that is always there anytime you reset time. So if you need some free money, there you go. It's generally a good time. Uh, but yeah, I want to go over here and deliver a fairy to a fairy. I mean, you know, it just seems like the thing to do, I think. All right. Hello, great fairy. I came back finally. I mean, it, to, I, to you, I've never been here before. Time travel's weird and all that. It's fine. Hello. Looking as polygonal as always. Oh, Tattle, you did it. You returned me back to normal. This is all I can offer you. I will ease your body and mind. Also known as heal you and refill your magic. You can float sometimes. That's pretty cool. Ah, uh, yes. Scattered throughout the temples or broken stray fairies like me. Please find a way to save them. Ah, allow me to grant you something good so that the stray fairies will not fear you. Ah, we got our first mask other than the Deku mask. It's the Great Fairy Mask. Uh, it attracts stray fairies to you. Uh, it's pretty useful if you want to actually find all of the stray fairies that will be hidden in the dungeons. So it's a good thing to kind of do this before you actually go on into a dungeon. In general. <laughs> Speaking of which, I have more money to deposit. Hey guy, I got more money. Let me deposit some right quick gonna make a deposit I mean yeah that's kind of the point right I'm gonna, I'm gonna deposit nine nine rupees that's a lot all right what's this you've already saved up 200 rupees here's your special gift yo adult wallet I can hold 200 rupees at once ah. yes it holds more than my old one I mean I had one of those before but uh, I left it at home it seems like the thing to do, honestly. Anyway, I have wasted kind of a lot of time as far as this day cycle goes. Uh, so I may want to turn into a Deku Scrub on accident because I swear to you, learning buttons is going to be hard when they are different from what I'm used to. I'm going to go ahead, actually, and uh, save my game, reset time. It seems like the thing to do. Generally, if you're resetting time, you want a Song of Soaring back to Clacktown and deposit your money and whatnot. 
It's generally a good idea. And next time, we got a temple to go to. Yeah, I'll see you there, and goodbye!